If you use the billing method of buy total hours for your classes, you will set up a fee schedule and, if you wish, a multi-student discount. Go to Tools, Edit Settings, and select Tuition Settings from the menu on the left. Click the Get Started Now button if this is the first time you are setting up your tuition settings. Each class can be assigned a tuition billing method of either by class fee or by total hours. For by total hours classes, you may add or edit your fee schedule here. Clicking the Add Fee Row button will add a row of zeros in the first row. After you save changes, it will move to the correct order. If a total hours amount isn't listed in your schedule, Jackrabbit will select the next higher total hours and use that tuition fee. Keep in mind, your fee schedule, billing cycle, and the tuition fee for each class work together when calculating the tuition to be posted to accounts. Next, check all the billing cycles you use. This is the range of days that you bill tuition for, regardless of when you post tuition fees. If you select each week or each month, select the day when the cycle starts. If you bill by session dates, be sure all your sessions have start and end dates by going to Tools, Edit Settings, Drop-down Lists. For a custom billing cycle, indicate the number of weeks in the cycle and the start date of the first cycle. Next, if you selected more than one billing cycle earlier, select the billing cycle for your classes billed by total hours here. You may set up a multi-student discount. Decide if you would like to use the discount listed for each student or if all the students in a family will receive the discount listed for the total number of students. If you use the discount rate listed for each student, you have the option of selecting whether the highest or the lowest tuition gets the lowest discount. On the class record, set the tuition billing method to buy total hours to enable tuition to post. If you selected yes for prorating in your tuition settings, you may uncheck prorate tuition to turn prorating off for this class. If the class should not be counted in the total number of hours for a student or family, check the Exclude from Total Hours Count checkbox. You may update your classes one at a time, or use the Edit All Classes function. Refer to our Help Center for more information.